So in today's video, I've come to share how I accomplish creating loose two strand twists in my hair. So this is sort of a tutorial. It's my how to as well as a summary of all the tips that I incorporate into how to make it really effective for fine natural hair. I will share those tips at the very end, but you'll see it and you'll catch glimpses of it as you watch the video. Now, as you can see, I have four band two knots in my hair and this one is banded. The reason for that being is I started on freshly washed hair. After washing my hair and deep conditioning it, I'm gonna show you the, pro the products that I use, but first off, let me get to the the why of how I started and laid my product. When you're doing loose twists, because you're not manipulating your hair a lot throughout the week and the goal is to try to keep these in for two weeks, you really want to make sure that your hair is very, very conditioned and it's very, very moisturized. When you deep condition your hair, that procedure on wash day is when you add the most moisture to your hair. Having fine hair, the key is to maintain some length by not manipulating the hair too much and loose twists kind of accomplishes that. At least I found that to be so true for myself. When I washed my hair, I washed it with my regular co-wash, Eden Body Works Coconut Cleansing Conditioner. To deep condition my hair, I used the main choices anti-breakage ancient Egyptian hair mask. That product, which is in the closet somewhere now, I didn't bring it out. I used that as my deep conditioner and after I washed it out I sectioned my hair and I worked through this product right here by Eden Body Works. This right here is their hydration serum, the Almond Marshmallow Hydration Serum. What I really love about this is it protects your hair from heat damage as well as it really does smooth the cuticle of the hair. So I use this over the leave-in conditioner, which was the Natty Naturals Lemongrass Leave-in Conditioner. I put this on first, followed by this. Then in order to protect the ends of my hair, I use the Main Choices Ancient Egyptian Split-In Treatment Serum. After working those products through my hair, I sectioned my hair off in four sections and I put in clips. Now, I've already gotten started, as you can see. I've completed this, this, and this to stretch my hair. When you are doing loose twists, you want to eliminate your obvious curl pattern. So, I wouldn't do them on freshly washed hair that's wet. I would never do loose twists on hair that's in its curliest state because it just doesn't come out as nice. The superstar of products that I use to do my loose twists is this black castor oil hair food by Tropical Isle Living. Tropic Isle Living. I purchased this a while ago. This goes a long way. Just a tiny mountain goes a long way. And now I'm going to show you how I do it on the section that has been banded. So after I worked all the products through my hair, I blotted out the excess water and oh one thing I did use that I didn't mention was I used a um the green tea rinse over my hair that was after I washed out my deep conditioner that was the one by Belvoir Organic and so I just used it as a rinse but I left it in my hair I did not actually rinse it out after applying all of the products into my hair I then blotted out the excess and I banded the length of my hair in four ponytails and this is to allow my hair to start stretching and drying, air drying, for just a, a short period of time. I want to say it's been in bands. It took me about probably an hour before I began to take everything down. I just wanted it to dry a little bit stretched. Now, you're not getting a lot of drying because your hair is compacted while it's in the bands, but it does dry some. As you can see, it's, it's pretty stretched, and my hair is damp. Whenever I do loose two strand twists, I do like to use the hair dryer because again, I want to eliminate my obvious curl pattern. I'm taking my glasses off. So using the tension blow dry method, I take my dryer and I put it on the second heat level. So not the coolest and not the hottest. And then I use the highest airflow. It didn't take long 
for me to eliminate the slight bit of water that was in my hair. But now here's where the hair food comes in. Because I want this to stretch a bit more and I also want to protect my hair from drying out, I take about that much of the hair food, emulsify it in between my hands till it's almost like melted. Well, till it is melted. And then I'm going to squeeze and smooth it down my hair. This literally transforms the way the hair feels. When it's time to twist, the hair is gonna be so soft, but it's not going to revert. Put it on my ends, and I kind of twist it around so that it really melts into the strands. I take more and I put it at my roots. Now you may think I'm making my hair oily, but not at all. I'm going to hit this with the dryer again Now that this section is completely dry, this is how I further twist my hair to eliminate my curl pattern. So I am then working this into a bantu knot, what you see here, a very stretched out bantu knot, not really tight because I'm not setting it for a style, I'm using it to stretch. And I just secure it so it doesn't come apart while it's stretching. So being that I have actually stretched the others, I want you to see how my hair got stretched using this method. When I undo the knot, look how much stretch I got. Like, you wanna get a decent amount of stretch so that your twist, when they're done, they're set. So it's a really good amount of stretch. I've eliminated my obvious curl pattern and you know she might be able to rock you a nice hairstyle you know where the hair is just stretched and you just wear it out maybe throw some twist in the front but yeah we're not going for that now for the twisting so I'm gonna put my hair up I'm not gonna twist my entire head here but I'm gonna be up for a while and in order to keep myself awake, as I mentioned in the previous video, I will be taking some supplements. So I was sent these mints by Viter Energy to try out. This is a spearmint flavor, but it comes in a number of flavors. And what it is, is it's actually a breath mint that also helps to boost energy while freshening your breath. First off, I have to tell you, it is so strong. It freshens your breath. And I've been taking these probably for the past two weeks. Not every single day, because you know, you don't need caffeine every day. I'm gonna put my glasses back on so I can actually read the label. The ingredients are sorbitol, caffeine, natural and artificial flavors, calcium stearate, vitamin three, sucralose, vitamin six, folic acid, vitamin 12, Oh, sorry, vitamin B12. These energy mints by Viter Energy can be found at goviter.com. I will leave a link in the description box below, but they come in a number of flavors. Cinnamon, they come in spearmint, they come in chocolate mint, which I already ate all of those. They come in peppermint, and they also come in wintergreen. As you can see, they come in these packets, but they also come in a tin, making it easy for you to carry with with you when you're on the go if you want to have something as a pick-me-up and a freshen up breath. I think these will make great pocketbook mints when you're going out after work or something and you need some energy but you also want your breath to be kind of fresh you know what I'm saying? For me when I need to sit up and twist my hair all night <laughs> hopefully not all night but twist my hair for probably about two hours when I've started my hair very late Popping one of these mitts is going to help keep me awake. My husband is out working, so I will be sitting up twisting my hair while waiting for him, and I'm going to take a mint. Now, this is spearmint. I love the taste of the peppermint. 
but the spearmint is really good too. Let's get started with the twisting now. finish doing the rest of my hair. I'll be back with the finished result. Two and a half hours later, or well, almost two and a half, like 220, I am done. So the loose twists are complete and these will last me for about two weeks. Yeah, I really like how loose twists make the hair look a lot fuller. And actually, if I don't know if you've noticed or if you can notice from the last time that I showed them, my hair has grown just a little bit more. Not a lot, but a little bit. I will be wearing my hair probably up. Maybe tomorrow I'll pull it up and just like secure it with a clip where the sides are down. I don't know. We'll see how how you know how I feel in the morning, how I want to style it. I'm not gonna do a whole bunch of like messing around with it or anything like that. But there's just so many benefits to the style. It's very low manipulation. Once the twists are in, it kind of looks like your hair is loose. And for fine hair, it also makes it look a lot fuller. I hope you have liked this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Share it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. I will catch you in the next video. And yes, my friend, those caffeine breath mints kept me awake. <laughs>